What's up guys and welcome back to Madden 20, a face of the franchise. Uh, we've got the Browns this week and it uh, looks like the right defensive end, Miles Garrett, is uh, hitting us up. He says, man, I can't wait to line up across from you this week. We got four down linemen about to pounce on you like starving wolves. We ain't going to call today until there's nothing left of you. Um... I'm going to say, let's let's intimidate him. We're, we're going to, you know, kind of clap back a little bit here. He said, uh, I've seen players like you. All it takes is one big play, a deep pass, a long run, and your spirit breaks. And I hope you're ready to pick up the pieces this week. Miles says, I guess we'll see, won't we? It's going to be a slugfest. I can't wait. All right. I feel like, give up two or few, two fewer sacks. I feel, I feel like we could do that. I feel like that was pretty reasonable there. You know what I mean? Like, I, I feel like, you know, both have respect for each other, obviously, want to do better than the other one, but I don't feel like that was... What's the word I'm looking for? I, I feel like that wasn't, like, harsh, you know what I mean? Like, that that was in good spirits, that was fairly sportsmanlike, and uh, I could appreciate that. But, uh, yeah, dude, the Browns, I mean, they're looking like they could be really solid this year. They had a, uh, a, a really nice offseason, some cool pickups and stuff, so... This should be an interesting hey, game. It's Hopefully it's pretty good. This is Madden 20 on EA Sports. Up next... We've got what should be an intriguing matchup. Intriguing. Between the Cleveland Browns and the Denver Broncos. I'll have scores around the league for you at the half. But it's time for a little football. So we'll hand it over to our broadcast team, Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. What up, Brandon and Charles? I'm excited to be here, man. We are back up in the Mile High City here in Denver. Rolling out with the squad, baby. Let's get it, man. Got Cleveland across the way. I, I can I can sympathize with Browns fans, man. As a Vikings fan for my entire life, not really a whole lot of winning going on, so I can understand that. I feel like both teams are kind of on the up and up a little bit, though. Looking pretty good, so hopefully, hopefully we can keep that up. But um, here we go, fellas. Running out in the field for the first time for the day. Getting some, some nice little warm-ups and stuff in. This game is beautiful, dude. Like, all, all the cutscenes and everything, I, I think they've really done a, a pretty good job with it. Nice little player intros and stuff. All right, let's get it. So it looks like they're going to get a score on the opening drive. And it's time for us to, uh, to get out there and go to work. Here we go, boys. I'm going to go for Stretch Alert Smoke. So I've been reading the comments... Some of you guys have been saying that Lindsey should be outperforming where he's been. And we need to start going to the outside more. Use his speed. I mean, that that hole opened up like the Red Sea being parted, bro. What in the world? We'll take it. But yeah, you guys said we should be going for, like, stretch plays and, like, tosses to the outside and stuff like that. And that should work a little bit better for us. So we'll, we'll see if, if that ends up working out. Oh, hello. Ah, uh, I was hoping he's going to be able to grab that. Kind of had the inside there. I'm going to go for the P-A-Y corner. I'm going to look for this Fanton Sutton cross over on the right side of the field. See who comes out on top. There we go. Got him. Oh, my. A was wide open. Fant was wide open. That was going to be a great play, but... Unfortunately, you guys saw what happened. We got a third and 17 here. We're gonna have to kind of wait on Hamilton. Dude, honestly, if you want me to be completely honest, I think a big part of our problem is the O-line on this team. Uh, people get through our O-line like it's nothing. It, it's like, it's so frustrating, dude. Got him. That was way far behind him, and it wasn't where we should have hit him, but we got him. But yeah, dude, I, I, feel like, I feel like that's a big part of why Lindsey doesn't do as well, and that's also why we get sacked all the time, because our, our O-line just doesn't. They... They couldn't hold a block if it freaking hit him in the face, man. I thought he came up with that, and I was going to say that was amazing. But he did not. All right, we're going to hit Fant to the outside here. Actually, probably Hamilton to the outside. Fant. Oh, my God, dude. Miles Garrett, he's the one to get it. I just, I, I don't even have the time to let my guys run their routes before people are all over me. I don't, I don't know what else I can do. Yeah, that puts him on pace. Let me do the rudimentary math here. To 
be sacked 12 times in a game. I know he's not going to go for that. I wonder if it's going to reshape. That's not going to get us the first down. Unfortunately, I didn't like anything else we saw. At least it's going to get us out of the end zone and give our punter a little bit of space. Bit of a rough start here, fellas. I'm not going to lie. Looks like our defense was able to hold out, though. We've got a pretty good field position, too. What was that, a turnover, maybe? We'll see. Got him. Wide open. Come on, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Let's let's start moving this ball down the field. we got a little bit of confidence here. Let's make this work. I'm going to hit I'm gonna hit Sutton in the end zone here. You guys ready for it? You ready for it? I'm calling it right now. Just kidding. We got RB right open. Let's go. Another big play. Woo! All right. The wheels are starting to turn a little bit here. I'm going to look for Sanders and his little slant to cross. Broncos with their first trip to the red zone thus far. Looking for Sanders and it's intercepted. I thought we were going to lead him a little bit more. You know what I mean? Like I, I thought I thought we were gonna throw it like behind that guy, not directly at him. Whatever. It's, I mean that's that's my fault, 100. percent That's the timing. I couldn't have even passed that ball if I if I pressed it right away. Two minute warning. Down 10 nothing. We are gonna be getting the ball back at the half. So if we can if we can put a drive together right here, we will be okay. That's a, a big if, though. Um, I'm going to look for the HB wheel. We're going to look for Hamilton or Sanders. Let's go. Good catch. I'm going to go no huddle. Let's get up there. I'm going to say let's go for the, the FB flail. We're going to look for Freeman. Shoot. I'm going to go ahead and call a timeout. I've, we got we to gotta take some timeouts. We've got three to mess with. Want to get the right personnel out there, actually take the time to call a play, that sort of thing. So we need to start looking to go towards the outside. I'm going to go for the corner strike. We're going to look for... Shoot, dude. I don't love this. We're going to go for it anyway. Get out! He's got his big you got to get out of bounds, bro. What are you doing? Now the Broncos going to use the second of their timeouts as they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. I'm going to go for the PA post shot. Going to try to hit him late over on the left side of the field. If we don't get sacked by then. Come on, baby. Get out of bounds. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. There needs to be a button to tell your players to run out of bounds. Well, this is how you shake the All right. that interception on the last drive. You come out and start this. I'm going to go for the weak head. flood here. We're going to look for I think I might look for for Sanders over the middle, dude. We'll see. Look for him here. Make sure you get out. Dude. Inside the 20 before he's brought down. Weak flood. The game here to the previous play is better than 40 yards total. Got him. That's not going to get us really anywhere. Dude, you guys need to get out of bounds. We have the chance to get out of bounds, and you're not going out of bounds. I don't understand. Slot cross. Here we go. We're going to hit Hamilton, hopefully. No, we had him. We'll take the, we'll take the three-pointer. We had him, but we got sacked. Did I? I'm not trying to make excuses, but I, our O-line is, is buns, I feel like. Go. We'll take it. We'll take it. I'm going to go for the slot stick. Let's just get a little, a little gain here. Nothing major. Just not playing as well as we need to. Let's pick it up. And we still have a chance to win this game. Got him. That's the first down. Let's go, baby. A gain of five. Good enough for the first down. I'm going to go for the roll right. I'm going to look for Sutton or Fance across the middle here. Here we go. To throw is Martin. Off the bootleg. He's going to let this one go deep. And that's caught. Bro, Sutton is a freaking beast. I shouldn't have thrown that ball, I'm going to be honest. He just bailed us out right there. That should have been, at the very minimum, a dropped, a dropped ball, if not a, a freaking interception. That that was ridiculous. All right, we need to score and tie this ball game up, dude. 
that wasn't ideal. Alright, I'm gonna look for the mesh spot. My first look is gonna be Sanders. If not, we're hitting Fant on the curl over the middle. He's gonna be our bailout plan. Sanders. Let's go. Let's go, boys. This is where things get really sketchy, though. You know what I mean? Alright, we're hitting, we're hitting Hewerman. Roll out right, run it ourselves, or hit Hewerman in the end zone. Did we get it? Oh my gosh, dude. The problem is, is we we don't put it in in these situations. I'm going to go for an FB run up the strong side. Dude, I, our line, it just... I think we'd be better off going from the shotgun and running the ball. And always going to be brought down by the face mask. Here come the face mask. This is going to get him a first down. We'll take it. Move the ball halfway to the goal line. All right, I'm going to go for a QB run. You guys remember what happened last time? We got absolutely screwed. But I'm hoping this is going to work. But you caused the play. You did it. I had to. No gain there as he kept it himself. It's second down. I'm just going to keep doing it, dude. There's no way. Thank you. I was going to say, there's no way if you do QB sneak three times in a row that you can't get an inch forward. Like, come on. All right. 10 10 ball game. Third quarter. Let's go for the. Ooh. What is this field position, dude? The defense is coming up clutch today, I'm not going to lie. Off the boot leg. I'll have you guys know that was to Y over the middle because he was wide open. I pressed Y. Were our feet not planted or what? I don't understand. I don't understand how that that could be that far off. Third and four. This is a big one, boys. This is a, a big, big, big play. I'm going to look for Ohio spacing. We're going to look for butt or fence. Here we go. Got him. All right. Got a fresh set of downs here. Going to be okay. I'm going to go for the PA drag wheel. We're going to roll out left, plant our feet, and hit Sanders. Got him. Oh, dude. Almost had him. We've seen good cover skills on display throughout this game. Really I'm gonna go for the PA cross here, kinda do the same thing. I feel like these are our biggest plays for sure. Oh, he just can't hang on to it. I mean those are tough catches. He's laying out for it. Texas double post. I'm gonna look for Fant or Lindsay here. This is I would expect to see some pressure here. Ideal if we convert this. And the blitz does come. And a throw there gonna be incomplete. Double coverage. I didn't really love anything else I saw. I, I don't know, dude. We'll take the field goal. We're gonna take the lead and we're gonna get the ball back. And now it's gonna be offense now as they get set to take over here. Cleveland has a second turnover of the game. Oh my gosh, dude. Alright, we need to put this in here. This is like the most monumental thing. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go for concept. We're gonna go for an, a quick pass. Or no, we want do we want option? Where are the rollouts at? Play action pass right here. I'm gonna go for uh I'm gonna go for the wheel slide. So we're gonna look for B or A and we're just gonna potentially run it in ourselves as well. We've got our best guys in the job. I'm gonna go for the same thing, dude. I, I believe in it. I believe in it. Here we go. Let's go, dude. I just, I, that gives you so many options. If I play it right, that puts me in a good spot. If I play it wrong, then it's my fault and we lose the game. So I, I kind of appreciate that. I'm going to go for an inside zone run here. We're going to start burning this clock. Let's go. The audible worked out well there, huh? Please don't say holding. Face mask. We'll take it. 
Give us another first down. Basically, we just want to start running down this clock, burning their timeouts. If we could get a first down here, that's going to be huge. Four, that's not bad. I'm going to say, I'm going to go for a, a mountain pose dig here. I am most likely just going to keep it myself. If we have a very easy open pass, I'll go for it. But I am most likely just going to keep it to myself here. Here we go, fellas. I'm nervous. This is... Oh, God. I didn't realize we had a, some action before the play there. I didn't... Oh, man. We almost got a delay of game penalty. That, that could have been real bad right there. All right. I'm going to go for the wheel slide. Same thing here. Most likely take it at myself. Just go for the slide. Hopefully get the first down. Oh, my God. So we need a first down now. I like this. I'm going to look for Fant across the middle, maybe Sanders. I'm going to burn the clock as much as we can. Dude, this, this, is, this is where the, the real OGs are made, man. We could make or break this game right here. Can't believe we had to burn a timeout on that last play, dude. So stupid. That's pass interference, dude. He had him beat, and he was cutting back across, and he... That, there was contact well before the ball was thrown there. Like, significantly before the ball was thrown. But our defense put in anyway. They put in work. They got it done. These guys have two timeouts. If we get a first down, that's game over. All we need is a first down here. I'm going to go for the HP stretch. We're going to make them burn both the timeouts. Oh, dude, you know what? I don't, I don't like it. I'm going to call timeout. I'm, I'm going to go for the first down. I'm going to go for the dagger. We're going to go for like a quick slant play or something. This could be a mistake, but it also could completely solidify the uh, solidify the win. I'm going to look for Sanders on the slant here. Got him. That's game. Good move out of Sanders, and that's going to be a face mask. We'll take it. We'll take it, baby. That is a, uh, that's a, that's a GG, man. Now we can just nail this thing out. So we got it done, boys. That was a, uh, that was a doozy of a game. I'm not going to lie. Worked out for us, though. We were able to make it happen. And, um, we're going to take a, a W. So if you guys enjoyed, drop a like. You did subscribe if you haven't already. I'm going to see you guys in our next game. Peace out. So this one will wind up a Denver victory. And it was their defense that led the way.